FDA may nix the word milk from your almond milk. <gasps> I knew it, man. I knew it was only a matter of time. I said, you can't milk an almond. <laughs> Every man oh man they're gonna call it almond drink or something along these lines what is a milk what is a milk i think about these things i i, I lay awake at night mo i'm looking at you mm -hmm. i'm looking right at you right actually what is a milk define it Shout out DJ Medusa. He wants Wait. Will to go ahead. You can go. Will can go ahead after. What is a milk? Define milk. Speaking of milk, we have two new milks. Two new milks. <laughs> okay, we'll get to the two new milks in a moment. But please give me your best definition of milk. We will compare it to the actual Webster's definition. What is the definition of milk? And I, and that's right. I said what? I don't know, man. Give me your best even take. Drink milk. Give me your best take. Define milk. Well, to me, milk is just. Uh, That's not the definition. Uh, well, it's just. <laughs> it's it's pre cheese. That's what milk to, is. To me, to <laughs> me, to me, the milk is just. Uh, <laughs> I start doing like a slam poetry or something. <laughs> what is a milk? milk? <laughs> With the scarf. That's what mine will be about. Uh, right. Just if you had to guess the Webster's definition of milk. I have milk, no idea. You refuse to even throw anything out there? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I wouldn't even know. Where okay, to give us the definition. Mo's stressing out about this. That's not what I want. <laughs> Liquid cheese. Go ahead. Uh, define milk. Milk definition. Um, I like that. An opaque white fluid rich in fat and protein secreted by female mammals for the nourishment of their young. Secreted sounds. Yeah, man, you can't, you can't be calling these milks, man. It ain't a milk. Never was a milk. Never will be a milk. You just wanted to sell it instead of milk. You wanted to piggyback on the success of the secreted milk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, a lot of people, they have problems with drinking secretions at this point. Mm -hmm. And so I think you want to have a substitute that feels like the thing because people have nostalgia around those terms. Marketing here is key. If it was called almond water, that just feels wrong, doesn't it? Yeah. Or whatever you like to drink, oat water. Ugh. Sounds sludgy. It sounds, this is just terms. What about oat juice? I mean, they can just call it drink, can't they? Oat drink, almond drink. I don't mind that. That's fine, right? Yeah. So we got to think about this, but there's definitely no secretions involved. The nut does not secrete. Mo, let's be clear. Right. The nut does not secrete. Not the, not the cashew the right or the almond or the oat. And the oat's not even a nut. And I, it, at least not willingly. <laughs> <laughs> at least not willingly. Shout out, Alexi. When you drop a box of almond milk into your shopping cart or order an oat milk latte, are you being bamboozled? That's the contention of big dairy. Oh, of course it's big dairy behind this. They're like, hey, wait a second. What you calling a milk? And, they, and you know they're bringing Webster to court. When they go to court, they're going to have the hard copy, yeah. the paper, mm -hmm. the, the, the paper copy of Webster's Dictionary. They're going to be like, <laughs> right. you see? That's a milk. Yeah, show me the secretion. Mm -hmm. And then uh, they're going to be like, but what about the environment and the cows and the methane and the torture and whatever? And they're going to be like Webster. <laughs> Webster said so. pointing at Webster. Oh, do you want to do the milk? The argument, as the National Federation of Milk Producers put it in a 2019 comment to the FDA, is that the existence of almond, etc., milk, as opposed to, say, almond beverage, means that we're being misled about the nutritional content of plant-based imitators relative to real dairy products, thereby causing harm to our nation's children and potentially other consumers. As the Federation argues, a cup of dairy milk, for example, contains 8 grams of protein, and the word milk makes consumers think that they should get the same from an equal amount of almond milk, which typically delivers just one gram of protein. What a ripoff. That's mm -hmm. what the dairy uh, lobby says. Dairy farmers of America, Canada, 
or whatever, because they're like, everybody's buying the nut milks. Mm -hmm. And so they would, they would not want that to happen. Obviously, they're producing a separate product. But I kind of agree with it, to be honest. I don't think it's going to stop people from buying it if you can't use the word. Maybe your sales would take a little hit. you got to re-educate people. But it actually seems kind of odd that if you're against the idea of milking the mammal, that you then use the same word to describe your beverage. And I know it's a lot like milk. You're attempting to mimic milk. But it's really not milk. But we, we've got away with uh, soy milk for a really long time. And they were pretty much the originals, right? Oh, yeah. But it just wasn't a big enough deal to be for the uh, mm -hmm. the milk lobby at the time, I guess. Now, I big, guess almond has been so big. big that, yeah, uh, big milk is going for almond and oat. Almond and oat are crushing at the moment. They're everywhere. Yeah. I can't get away from it. Let me ask you a question. Then, do you think that all these non-milks will have to s work together and solidify like a real word for it? Uh, well, beverage is available, oh, and it's too long. Uh, and drink is available. Liquid, almond liquid. Oh. Okay. Pass me the almond liquid uh. for my cereal. No, it's just kind of weird when you actually look at it. Because you are curious, and we've had the word milk for so long, we just went with it. But, it, like, what did the meat companies do when they did the Beyond? Or they did the Impossible? They didn't call it beef. Right? They couldn't call it beef. No. But, but they, they still, did say burger. Yeah, or patty. Patty, well, the patty conversation, don't get me started on that one about uh, Jamaican patty. Remember you sent me the clip? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the What's, really Canadian. Uh, it was so clip. Canadian, but the history of it, because it's huge here, uh -huh. Jamaican patties. Um, shout out Tweeties. Buttermilk, buttermilk, is that really a milk? Oh, yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, <laughs> yeah man. It's tough. Juice? I guess you can use juice. Are you happy with that, Will? No, not a fan. Imagine oat, putting oat. juice in your tea. Oat juice? Or your coffee. Um, it's probably going to be drink or beverage. I got to tell you right now. If they don't, if they can't for whatever reason use the word milk, that's what it would be. Unless they make up a new word. Like Ooh. soylent. I doubt it. I doubt it, man. That that word milk is powerful. People still have nostalgia around it. They they yeah. want to add it to things, coffee and uh, cereals, and it just what about, f feels uh, right. What about cream? Almond cream? You got to look up the def oh, You got to see what Webster says about that. Because they also say coconut cream. They go coconut cream pie, don't they? They do, yeah. But that has nothing to do with the cream itself. Cream. The thick, white, pale, yellow, fatty liquid which rises to the to the top when milk is left to stand. Yeah, you're still tied into milk. Nah, yeah. Cream would be good. You're out of here, Will. You're out of line. <laughs> Somebody says soup. <laughs> oh. Good Lord. Here's a crazy video showing an orangutan attacking a man in a zoo. This was trending on Twitter yesterday. Hmm. Um, and it kind of goes to show how powerful this... Uh, this animal is got the shirt Whoa. and they got oh, the strong oh, no. grip Whoa! it's angry oh my god he, he he is angry oh oh my god what would you do in this circumstance like what what is the Cry. right protocol he's got you know what's crazy they have it has four hands yeah. yeah. Look how many grips yeah. are on there. Oh my god, he's like sideways. Biting the knee. Give me a bite. Oh. What's that, Mo? Oh. Excuse me, the Mo? The panic in that. Oh, oh my That's god. Very yeah. scary. Uh, video widely shared online and by TMZ. The man gets around a foot or two away from the bars of the cage and the orangutan uses this opportunity to grab his shirt and drag him forward with alarming ease. Yeah, the strength is out of control. Yeah. You can't gauge it because they don't look that. They, no, they, exactly. They don't look like a bodybuilder. No. 
but they don't have to. Various forms of apes and orangutans have been known for their violence against each other and humans, and in 2016, two orangutans teamed up to kill another scientific American reported. Oh, they ganged up to kill another orangutan. They can lift up to 226 kilograms, 500 pounds. Just a quick 500 lifted up. Wow. Three times their body weight. I'm guessing this guy's okay. There's no uh, details. It's the multiple grip. Whoa. You don't want you don't want to wrestle with that guy. He's got the multiple too many grips, right? Your yeah. legs and, and like your foot is kind of useless compared to he's got four grips. When he adds the foot in there, it's too much to handle. He's got three grips on the leg and one grip on the fence applying torque. Now he's not happy about something. He's like you're going down. Oof. Oh, oof. Yeah, this video kind of ends abruptly. Um, hopefully he's okay. Of course it would. Viral clip. They always end abruptly, don't they? Yeah. Lacking context. What happened? Is the man okay? But it was really big on Twitter the other day. Oh, shout out to another Mo in Abu Dhabi who says Super Chat is finally available in there. Oh, in, wow. Shout out. Oh, cool. Uh, over there in UAE. Mm -hmm. you I didn't know, know it was You didn't know that. Now you do. <laughs> Send 30 points to Apple while you're at it. <laughs> How do you know he's got an iPhone? Uh, no, I don't. <laughs> Google, whoever. <laughs> Send something to somebody, including us. 